Okay, welcome back to another cheat day video. It's Saturday morning, June 25th. It's 11.30 in the morning. We got a little bit of a late start, uh, but the training is done. So you'll, you'll see that in the video. I had a decent training session. We're ready to indulge in some cheat day stuff. So I'm excited. I know my girlfriend's excited. It's just one of those days again where we get to have whatever we want. So we are gonna go into BJ's and we're gonna pick out everything that we want to have for this amazing cheat day today. So stay tuned and we'll take you along for the little journey in BJ's and show you what we're picking out. So stay tuned. Here we go. You ready? We got our first pick, an assorted thing of cookies and brownies. So here's our first pick and we're still rolling here at BJ's. Second pick, apple turnovers. These are gonna go absolutely fantastic with the huge amount of cookies we just got. So <laughs> another one. Next pick is we went with assorted cheesecake. We're all we're hitting all the desserts right now, somewhat slash breakfast with the turnovers, but for the most part, this is uh, this is all desserts. Don't worry, we'll get to the other real food in just a moment. So now we're starting to get into a little more of the food food and breakfast type. So we went with the four cans, 32 in total, uh, cinnamon rolls. So I think we're gonna start with these early. So another pick here. We're over in the breakfast sandwich section, add into our breakfast, and we got some sweet maple griddle cake. So we're gonna try that. Going with chicken cordon blue bites. We're gonna add this to probably our, let's say lunch. So with these. Stayed right in the same section. How convenient is that? <laughs> and we're going with the buffalo chicken bites. These things are fantastic. Toasted raviolis, always an easy go-to. And we got two and one-fourth pound of toasted ravioli, definitely. That is now, heavy. You got two. Huh? Oh, there's two. There's two in this. Oh. So, Next pick is we're going with the Stouffer's mac and cheese. Four trays in this bad boy. Um, so this looks really good. <laughs> we're at BJ's, we got to always do a little sampling and of course BJ's is always good for that. So we're gonna try a little sample here. And it looks like we have a s'mores combination. I'm just gonna shoot this bad boy right down. <laughs> Fantastic. All right, guys. We just picked up some wavy, hit the wavy chips. Got to hit the wavy chips. Wavy chips. Yeah. And, and of course, we're going with the good old. Hell of a the, good. Hell of a good. The, I would say, the number one staple of chip dip in the whole entire world. <laughs> okay. We just finished up our cheat meal shopping at BJ's. What a fabulous experience. We got. We were actually able to sample a few things too. We had the s'more sample stack that was hanging out there. Um, it was pretty good, but great experience at BJ's shopping for our cheat meal stuff. We'll show you everything that we got. Obviously you'll see it in the video, but we'll also uh, do a little uh, uh, showcase of it when we get back to, back to the house. But before we get back, we are starving. So we're gonna kick this cheat day off with the apple turnovers that we picked up. Uh, and we're gonna give these a try. <laughs> okay. Okay, we're just finishing up a few apple turnovers. Uh, we're gonna get out of BJ's <clears throat> and head back to the house. So we'll see you when we get back. Yeah, can I get a number one, a large with a Diet Coke? 
Yeah, can I get a number three? A large with a Diet Coke? And can I have a caramel frappe? Uh, medium, please. Yeah, and a large vanilla shake, please. That's it. Awesome, thanks, man. Getting filthy on a cheat day. At the first window, making our payment of $32 here at the Golden Arches. What's going on, buddy? We're on it, man. It's great. You guys are flying today, huh? Holy cow. Busy, busy. Rush hour. Everybody's getting after it. I don't think the rain helps. Yeah, well, you got school, schools out. Yeah. People are rocking and rolling. Keep up the good work, man. All right, we just finished up at the first window and made a payment. And um, boy, the, the, the kid back there, first of all, working his butt off, it's rush hour, but boy, did he make a great point. Uh, he says that the that they're busy. One of the reasons that they're busy is that the rain doesn't help. And I'm quoting him and saying that. And we were just talking, and that makes sense. People don't want to get out of their vehicles to go into the store or into the restaurant. They don't want to load their groceries in the pouring rain, so they say, screw it. I'm going to go to McDonald's and hope that the rain holds off, and then maybe I'll go grocery shopping later. Exactly. So there, there you heard it there, too. It bought... But then again, what, what wise wisdom from a young McDonald's employee on a Saturday at work and just at work. There you go. So we're at the second window picking up our goodies. And once again, the workers in here are just killing it, busy. They are just slanging burgers and fries. A lot of young workers in there, which is good. It's good to see. Good money too yeah, for really, them. Yeah, yeah, really good. How you doing? Good. Sure. Guys are busy, huh? Yeah. It's that time. Plus the kid back there says it's raining, so <laughs> it's like people don't want they're all in the drive and drive drive through. Well we appreciate it though. You guys are working hard. Thank you. Ooh. All right, we are back at the house, finished up our cheat meal shopping, and we'll just give you a quick run through of what we got. Uh, try to keep it short and sweet. So, toasted raviolis, apple um, turnovers, wavy chips, and of course, Cool Ranch Doritos, one of my favorites. And we also have the hell of a good dip to go with the wavy uh, chips here. We stopped at McDonald's, as you saw, and we got a quarter pounder, uh, meal, a Big Mac meal, uh, two shakes. I got a vanilla shake and my girlfriend got a caramel frappe. We also have our two Diet Cokes that came with the meal and of course fries. Our buffalo chicken bites, they're fantastic. McGriddles from BJ's, they look really good. Cinnamon rolls, mac and cheese, a cheesecake out in front. We have uh, cookies uh, that you saw at BJ's as well. This continues our cheat day for today. So stay tuned, a lot of good stuff coming from this epic cheat day. So we'll see you guys in just a little bit. All right guys, we are sitting down and getting ready to enjoy another part of this cheat day with, and as you just heard, our oven is ready because we have our cinnamon rolls uh, and also we have some McGriddles over there uh, from BJ. So we're gonna definitely indulge in those. But before we do that, we're gonna enjoy our meals from McDonald's. I went with the Quarter Pounder uh, and the Big Mac over here for my girlfriend. And of course we got the fries. We both got shakes. Mm. So we're going to begin eating this.
Okay, we're back again, and we have another part of the cheat day. And what we have now is the McGriddles from BJ's, uh, pancake, sausage, and egg. We have our cinnamon, Pillsbury, um, you know, the, 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 uh, no, I know, but you, you do that, the one that when you push his butt, belly, he goes, woo, or something, remember that? <laughs> Pillsbury Doughboy. Pillsbury Doughboy. So we have our traditional Pillsbury Doughboy cinnamon rolls. These are classics. I'm sure you're well aware of them. Just something that we spotted and said, why not? Uh, but yeah, these are going to be good. So we are going to begin eating. So enjoy. Wow. Mmm. It tastes just like McDonald's. It's really good. All right, welcome back. We are going to continue our cheat day and we are going with next our toasted raviolis and our chicken cordon bleu bites. We're gonna throw these bad boys in the oven and get ready to indulge in another fantastic feast on this amazing cheat day, so stay tuned. So here we are once again with another cheat meal of this cheat day and we are going with Cordon Blue Bites and toasted cheese raviolis. A little bit of marinara sauce here, so we are going to begin our next cheat meal. So, enjoy. All right, we're just wrapping up another meal. This was, again, the chicken cordon blue bites and the toasted ravioli. Before this was the, um, the McGriddles from BJ's and also the cinnamon buns, your Pillsbury uh, cinnamon buns. And absolutely everything has been incredible so far uh, from the apple um, turnovers to the McDonald's, Quarter Pounder, and Big Mac, the McGriddles, the cinnamon rolls, and now the Cordon Bleu bites and the uh, toasted raviolis. Everything has been fantastic. So we're just gonna finish up the rest of these and we will see you guys in just a little bit, so. <laughs> I hope people can see this. I know. Okay. <laughs> All right. What's up? GK is still rocking and rolling. Don't get much. <laughs> Don't get much better than this. We are watching a movie. Saturday evening. Watching a movie and uh, enjoying some Lay's wavy chips. Got to go with the wavy, especially when you're using the dip. A uh, little more strength to these bad boys when you're dipping so you don't break a little chunk off in there and spend another couple more chunks of the same. Trying to find it. No, don't. Yeah, because no, when they break off, you're trying to find the chip. And then you break the more. Chip. And then yeah. you break more of the chip. Yeah, so, yeah. go with the wavy, a lot tougher, a lot stronger. Um, just a better chip for dipping. So, and then we have just our Cool Ranch Doritos. To be honest, there was no intentions of dipping the Doritos in the uh, hell of a good dip, but we might. So, that'll be pretty cool and interesting. But. We are watching a movie and we're gonna enjoy, this is not a cheap meal, this is just a snack in between, uh, because in just a little bit, we are going to start cooking 
our last cheat meal uh, of the day. And then followed by that is going to be uh, some amazing, delicious desserts. As if you already saw in the beginning of the video, what we picked up at BJ's, uh, we have the assorted cheesecake and we have the assorted cookies and brownies from BJ's. So that is exciting. So a lot more still to come. So stay tuned. And also, if you haven't already, please like, share, and subscribe. So if you haven't already, please like, share, and subscribe. A uh, ton more content coming out. We have a blast doing this stuff. <laughs> we have a blast doing this stuff. So I sure hope you're enjoying, uh, enjoying all of this. Uh, we average about 50, maybe 60 views for every video. So we're really... <laughs> We're really excited and happy for all of that. For all we, of we appreciate all you that are viewing. Now, in all seriousness, thank you. If, you. if you have subscribed and you do enjoy the videos, we just love having fun and doing these things. Uh, obviously training and eating, but I could ramble on forever about that. But if you, did, if you have subscribed and or if you either watch the video and don't subscribe, it doesn't matter. But for just watching the video, thank you. Um, it really is pretty cool because we really do enjoy doing this stuff. Uh, but with that, we'll see you guys in just a little bit. We're going to sit here and munch on some chips and finish watching our movie. So we'll see you soon. Okay, we are back with yet again another cheat meal. And we have gone with Dofer's mac and cheese and our buffalo chicken bites. Correct? Correct. This is buffalo chicken spring rolls. <laughs> buffalo chicken spring roll bites. We're gonna use some buttermilk ranch. I'm not the biggest fan of ranch, but with the buffalo, I'll, I'll do it. I like blue cheese a lot better, but we didn't have any of that in the uh, uh, in the cooler. So we're going to enjoy ourselves with yet again a beautiful cheat meal. So we'll see you in a little bit. So we are going to finish up and or try to finish up. We are we are definitely getting there. It's been a great day, but a lot of food. But we're gonna do our best to finish these up. The uh, buffalo chicken spring bite rolls, whatever you wanna call them, are really, really good. The Stouffer's mac and cheese, it's okay. It's not great, it's okay. I wouldn't say it's anything special. If you're familiar with like the Velveeta cheese, uh, macaroni and cheese, uh, Kraft macaroni and cheese, of course. And then, you know, if you're good at making your own homemade mac and cheese, this is decent though for, for what it is. And, you know, uh, but it's not a real like ton of cheesy flavor, which I guess is not a bad thing, but on a cheat day, we're looking for that cheesy, cheesy flavor. So, but it's okay, not bad. But the Buffalo um, Bites here things, they are really good. We've had them before. Uh, they are definitely fantastic. So we're going to finish enjoying this and we will catch you guys back in just a little bit because we have some dessert coming to include the variety pack cheesecake and some cookies and brownies. So we will see you guys in just a little bit as we look to finish out yet again another amazing cheat day. So we'll see you soon. And here it is, the final cheat of our cheat day ends with cookies. It's like we got a uh, white chocolate macadamia or macadamia nut. Uh, looks like chocolate on chocolate, with chocolate chunks, chocolate chip over there or chocolate chunk chip, whatever you want to call it. Uh, brownies in the middle. And then we have for our cheesecake, 
New York style blueberry swirl chocolate, raspberry, white chocolate, brownie, strawberry swirl, and turtle. So we are going to enjoy these and really bring home the cheat day. It's late, but we're still going <laughs> as, we, as we always do. So we are going to enjoy this and let you know how it goes in just a moment. So here we go. Is all over a cheat day all wrapped up the cheesecake was fantastic we basically took bites of all the different kinds um, the cookies just finishing up here all the cookies were fantastic uh, everything has been just great and we have a <laughs> we have a ton left over which is fine um, I know our kids will probably enjoy it so without further ado that's about it so yeah that does it for us and until next time until the next cheat day, which is counting down seven days away, we'll be back and rock and roll with another one. So definitely stay tuned and we'll see you soon. Like, share, and subscribe.